Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be taking another look at the Nikki Tutorials and Beauty Bay palette. Um, the last time I used the red and the purples, but today we'll be using the blue, the green um, and the blue shimmer. So basically the colors I will be using uh this one amsterdam hue and mama tutorials this blue shimmer and i also do use the whites to um kind of like emphasize my inner corner just to make it pop above the blue so those are the four shades i'm going to be using today um just to mention i've been seeing and hearing things about this shadow saying it's patchy or whatever it is not patchy it's just because it's pigments the way you work with pigments are different as i will show you in the tutorial how you can use pigment without it turning patchy if you like what you see then um, please hang out with me and see how i achieve this um look okay thank you keep watching okay so going first into the blue shade which is called amsterdam this is the right brush for it but i'm gonna use that on my outer corner just packing it on because these shadows are pigments really so we are not really meant to be swiping you're meant to just lay it down so laying down that shade and that's what i'm doing so so as you can see i'm not i'm not like blending i'm just literally just laying it down and that's how you work with pigments you're doing swipe you just kind of pack it on all right the blue shade is now laid down now um all over my eyes i think it's pretty much equal one thing i would say about this shade is it's not it loses in intensity and you have to kind of like repack it on that's the only thing i've noticed i mean it is blending all right even with my tapping it's kind of blending on the edges but it's almost like you have to re-intensify the color and it could be with the shade it might not be to do with the palette but this kind of shades can be pretty much difficult because it's kind of in between blue and purple all right i don't really know where this is going but i'm thinking of putting the green shade in the in the front part of my eye and possibly to blend out the blue or oh, we see how it goes and the green shade is called hue as mentioned so i'm just gonna pack that in the front of that blue and then i might just bring it up to blend the blue so that's what I'm doing. So I'm just chopping it in. Basically wrapping it around that blue. And when I get to the edge, I'm just going to be very careful. So that it doesn't spread too far. So just wrapping it around that blue. Okay. I think, yeah. That's as far as I want it for now. Doing the same on the other high. Alright, I think I've pretty much got it even now. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to bring the blue on my lower lid as well. Just so that it matches. But for this I'm using a smaller brush. So I'm just tapping. I'm pressing. Okay, that's pretty much wrapped around now. So what I'm going to use that small brush again for is to kind of reapply it where it meets the green so i'm literally like bringing the blue black back again is with these shadows you might have to go back and forth now i'm bringing the green i'm kind of blending it into the blue now Alright, the next thing I'm going to do now is now use a very fluffy brush to now blend the green upwards. So be very careful not to dislodge the blue again. So literally the brush is just touching the green. I'm blending it. That's why I'm going to stop for now. So I'm just going to do the same on my second eye. 
think they're pretty much the same now i'm just going to use a little bit of the green again to kind of like clean up under the blue not not really cleaning up but just to make it match um top and bottom right that's pretty much it so the next thing now is to put a shimmer shadow and i'm like i said i'm thinking of using that mama tutorials so we're gonna go into that blue shade now the blue shimmer and um the blue shimmer that one right there i might use any of the other ones but we'll see but for now it's the blue one i want to use um i might maybe use it as a cut crease yeah would have to say strong <laughs> all right i've got the blue shimmer laid down so what i'm gonna do now is to um merge to kind of blend the blue shimmer to the matte blue so going back into the brush i use for my um, lower high just because it's kind of like densely packed even though it's still fluffy and i'm now gonna kind of like um, blend it together so i'm more or less like turning my brush um I'm, I'm using the angle from from the shimmer to kind of blend it together and then i'm gonna go back into the shimmer with my finger and use that to blend together so literally pressing it down so i'm pressing that blue shimmer down just repeating the process That will do for now. I'm gonna do the same on the other high and I'll be right back. Alright, I'm back. Um I've done the second high and what I did was I used this shade, this whitish shade, um on the inner corner of my lower lid and I'm gonna do the same um on the on the other side now. So going into that it really with like a an angled brush. And I'm just gonna lay it down gently so I'm gonna spray again just to avoid them um, any fallout and I'm laying that so I'm now just gonna blend it together with the blue so going back into the Amsterdam I'm gonna make sure it blends into my into each other Alright guys, that's it. So both eyes are now the same. So I'm so going to line my eyes now and put on my mascara and I'll be right back to show you what the finished look looks like. Alright guys, I'm back with the finished look. So I didn't apply any first lashes. It's just um, mascara and um, I've got my liner on. So again, as usual, I used the Revolution mascara and liner and this is what it looks like. So I'm going to zoom you out just so you can get the impact um, just from a little bit far back. Okay, that's the end of the tutorial. That is what my eyes look like from afar. Um, hope you've enjoyed um, today's tutorial. Um, I'll try and again and use this palette a third time. Um, I will link also the first time I used this palette when I when I used the purple shade and the red shade. I will link it to this video. But today I thought I will use the greens and the blues. I hope you've enjoyed it. Um, and I hope you've also enjoyed hanging out with me today. So thanks for watching. If you like this video, please give it a like. And consider subscribing to my channel for more looks. Thanks for watching.